Well, let's begin this morning with the severe weather that killed at least six people, including two children in Tennessee. NBC's Marissa Parra is in hard hit Nashville. Marissa, good morning. What does it look like there? Willie, good morning. It's still dark here, but if you look over my shoulder here, you can see two buildings reduced to rubble. We're talking about a church, a community center, and it was here that the city of Nashville says 13 people had to be rescued from inside when they collapsed. Now, if you look at those images of the tornadoes passing through Tennessee, it is striking. You see flinging debris, snapping power lines, igniting fires, explosions, and causing a lethal amount of damage. Now, one of the hardest hit areas nearby Nesbitt lane now destroyed. According to police, three people were killed when a mobile home flipped on top of a nearby residence. And in Clarksville, Tennessee, another three people killed and roughly two dozen taken to the hospital as the storm ripped through on Saturday. And across the middle of the state, you see downed power lines, cars with broken windshields in places like Hendersonville. Now, there are still 44,000 people across the state without power. We know the mayors of both Clarksville and Nashville have declared a state of emergency. And we also know that local fire departments are going around to collapse buildings, making sure no one is still waiting for rescue. Willie. Mm. And Nashville has far too much experience with this kind of extreme weather. Marissa Parra in Nashville for us this morning. Marissa, thank you. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel today all day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or Click the link right here.